Tori, and welcome to my first She Conversation show. I'm super excited to do this segment. I mentioned to you, I think in my intro video, that I would be doing this, and so it's long overdue. Um, I've been waiting to do this, and um, I'm just super excited. So the show will be where I'm having conversations with amazing people, and just kind of sharing what brands are going on, a life, a lifestyle, you know, events and all of that. So just sit back and I would love for you to just enjoy a little bit of conversation. So today's topic is going to be sustainability. Um, that's a passion of mine and I've over the years it's become more of a passion. And so I thought why not have my very, very first guest um, talk about sustainability. So first of all, Welcome, Miss Tristan. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for coming. Of you know how that you Yes, yes, my <laughs> official first show. I'm yes. so excited. Well, congratulations. Um, this is cool. Thank I like you, this. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, we'll be we'll, we're speaking now. We're coming back. Girl, I remember the first yes. show. <laughs> yes, we're going to be saying that. So, so okay, let's get right into it. So, how do uh, how do how? Let's tell people how do we meet. Yes, um, school, art institute, yes. college, um, yes. fashion classes. Yes, the yes. The classes are very small and tight knit, so we yes. got close pretty fast. I right, feel like, yeah. exactly. And yeah. I, of course, we share the common interest thing, mm -hmm. so it was yes. super cool. Like we clicked like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I felt like when we were there, it was like. Oh my people! Literally, Finally, that's it. people that. Yes. That's exactly how I felt because I did. So I did my first two years of college at Virginia State, and I love Virginia State. I had the time of my life. Mm -hmm. Like it was a party. Like, but I felt like I wasn't learning anything. Right. Like I was going to class. Like my grades were okay, but I wasn't learning what I needed to learn. Like to progress in my field. So that is exactly how I felt. As soon as I got in class, I'm like, oh, okay. Like, oh, no, these, these, are, these are people. Yeah, yeah, like, you get oh, me. Oh, you got me. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> yes, exactly, exactly. All right, so we're going to get into your brand a little bit later, but I wanted to get, bring up a little um, memory of when we went to New York Fashion Week. Yes. <laughs> uh, like, look, if you tell me your version of it. Okay, so my version, um, for one, so we took the bus. Yes. The Chinese bus. <laughs> <laughs> Those y'all who don't know, the Chinese bus is like I think we pay like maybe thirty dollars if that round trip. Yeah, round trip, <laughs> and um, it takes you to and from New York. Do we have the whole bus? No, oh, there was other people up there. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah there was other people. That's other right. random people and up yes, there. Yes, yes, yes. So that was an experience because I think the first I took the bus was like to DC one time. Okay, like in high school, but so we took the bus all the way to New York. Um, <laughs> <laughs> We're rolling down yes, New York with our diva, luggage, like divas. And my yes. is it's Fashion Week, so it's like, like busy as heck. It's crazy. Like, yes, yes. And yes. I'm just like feeling like, okay, yeah. oh, excuse oh, me, pardon me. You know, we're all southern. Like, oh my bad. Like, yes, yeah. And we're like, sorry, man. And I'm everybody sorry. just like, whatever. Yes, yes. So that that was a lot for me out the gate. Like, I'm like, okay, whew, this is <laughs> this is gonna be a bit much. Um. So then, once we got checked in the hotel, well, when we pulled up to the hotel, I thought. Oh, oh right we were like yeah we done made it yes that, that hotel the outside was, was so, so nice oh my god right. like yes, yes. it's gonna be nice we're right. checking in like yes. we can't wait yes and this was really before like instagram shots yeah you know, yeah the, <laughs> instagram look at the, him look at the front the yeah. front <laughs> but we went in y'all and <laughs> I don't even know where to start with we the hotel. Should, do we even have pictures? I I had to look on my old phone. I know. I know I do. Because I know I was taking pictures of like the mold. It was like mold Molding, in the bathroom. Oh, the, so we, it was four of us. Mm -hmm. And we yeah. had, and our room was huge. Yeah, it was a good it size room. Yeah. for New York. I couldn't believe how yeah. big. But yes, that that was quite an experience. Yeah, definitely. With, if we weren't, it wasn't up to our standards <laughs> at all. <laughs> Um, and then a one funny thing that I remember is Angelica. Mm -hmm. Whenever we would go out, so it was, it was Tristan and I, Angelica, and another girl, Jen. And so, you know, we had some downtime. We would go to dinner or wherever. Angelica would stop at every mirror. Yeah. <laughs> a picture. Like, every mirror. Like, that was, like, so funny. You gotta funny. get the shots. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. And remember, she kept saying she was looking for her husband at basketball. Well, she saw Iman. <laughs> Iman, if Iman, if you're watching this, we saw you. Yeah. Oh, outside the hotel. Yes, outside, the outside, the outside yes. our fancy hotel. Yes, yes. He was, was walking back. He walked past. Yes. And then she was, like, she started screaming. And I got scared. Because yeah. I'm, like, I'm, like, the mom of my yes. friends. Yes. So she's, like, oh, my God. I'm, like, oh, my God. What? 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 what, 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 what happened? Yeah. And she's like, is he mine? And I'm like, who? Like, because I'm like, thank 
fucking like do we know him? Yeah. Him? She was right. like, right, I'm not, I'm not. Yeah. And I was and I saw the back of his head and I'm like, girl, you gotta be scared. Yeah, like like something's wrong, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that was that was quite an experience. Yeah. So, what did you like working the fashion? The work show? the work, working the fashion show was like super cool. Yeah. Um I think that was like an experience I probably would never have experienced if I wasn't with the school. Yeah. Um that was pretty cool just to see the different designers, because I, I think they were emerging designers. Yes. And, but their stuff looked like top. Yeah. yeah like, like they had like, that's their 15 collection. Right. Exactly. Yeah, not their first. Exactly. Yeah. And it was, yeah. it was amazing to see all that. And it was inspiring because then I didn't know I was going to get into design. Yes. Um, but it was inspiring to see those um, young people because I believe they still were in college as well. Yeah, yeah. And we got to meet the um, other stylists and stuff from Atlanta. And so yes, that was the experience that was, too. Yes. It, it was. Yeah. But it was definitely fun and yeah. inspiring the whole time. Yeah. yeah and so, like I said, I, I, I still have my little lanyard and yeah, everything. Yeah. Because I'm like, I went to Fashion Week. Yeah. Yeah. I went to Fashion Week. Yes. yes. Were you front of the house or back house? I can't remember. Um, when I, we were front of the house. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah, that's right. Yep, yep. Oh, yeah, we had to make sure the models were all walking. Their, their right, point. yeah, we got to walk, we got to walk down the runway because yeah, that yeah, showed them how to do it. Yeah, yeah. Yes, <laughs> that was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. So, do you have plans to go back? Um, actually, yes. Okay. I was speaking into it. Yes. Okay. Um, I was actually this season. Um, I didn't know that it started in 2012. I just did a little bit of research. Mm -hmm. Um, there's a traveling small business fashion week, oh. and they just did New York. Um. And I want to say they're about to do Atlanta nice. now. I'll just, um, I'll, I'll have to look up their Instagram. Yeah, I'll give it to you. Yeah. Um, but I think I want to try to audition for that um, soon. Yes. Um, they come in. I think they did one in Richmond as well, too. Okay. So I'm like, okay, well, oh, yeah. next year you, or yeah. two. You, I'm like, yeah. I need to you do all the seasons. Yeah. All, 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 all the cities. All the cities. Yeah. yeah. I'll pull up to y'all. But yes. yeah, it was, I'm like, yeah, I got to get back to New York. Um. I want to get back to Houston too. I haven't shown in Houston, but Houston, I don't know. I just love Houston. Yes, so I feel you, like it would yes. be like a full circle for me to show there. Oh, so, yes. Yeah. Were you, cause you lived there for a little no, while. No, I, I lived in Charlotte. That, okay. But I wanted to move to Houston. That That's was the right. original plan. But gotcha. I think Houston just had, I don't know why I love Houston. Like when yeah. I go visit, it feels like home. home like, to you. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Oh, you know, I'm a Texas girl. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's back up a little bit. Mm -hmm. How, tell us about your brand. And so again, this, this topic is about sustainability. Mm -hmm. And of course, I thought of you because I love what you do. So just kind of explain like what your brand, uh, we know who you are and the mm -hmm. brand and all that stuff. So, so my brand, um, Fix by Tricks, um, I basically upcycle thrifted pieces, um, anything really, if it's already made or I've even made things from like curtains. Mm -hmm. um, my favorite thing I've ever made was a... A jacket from a shower curtain. Yes. That was like my. I'm still mad. I'm not mad. I sold it, but, but it's like, oh my god. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yes. Um. That's basically what I do, and I find joy in that because it's to me it gives me a little bit of a challenge yeah. to try to like figure out oh what can be done with this, and like I said, it helps with the earth. Like you're mm -hmm. reusing something that's already yes. been you know purpose for something else. Yeah. And. I'm doing my part in my mind to reduce oh. by, you know, carbon footprint because, yes. you know, the fast fashion is, yeah. is quick or whatever, but to me, doing this sustainable and repurposing, it gives me a sense of um, individuality yes. and, like I said, contributing to, like, sustainability. Yeah, absolutely. That's what, when I found out about your brand, I, that, I fell in love with immediately because mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, A, like you said, it's unique, mm -hmm. so you're not going to see the same exact thing. thing so yeah. that gives even the person as a customer and mm -hmm. a client a sense of oh I can be unique in right, this, you yeah. know and then too I think even if we're not aware when you hear your brand message it's like oh yeah I would like to help out if mm -hmm. I can you know we I was talking earlier to someone we know fast fashion is here it's a multi-billion dollar corporation right. mm -hmm. but if we can do things like, like you said, reuse, upcycle mm -hmm. it, you know, then we're, we're doing our part. And I totally agree with you saying, yes, that we're doing our part mm -hmm. by that. So I love that. Um, so what, so I have this thing where I would like to say, what is chic to you? Mm -hmm. So what do you, what do you feel is chic? Um, to me, chic is, um, just going back to individuality. Yeah. I feel like chic doesn't look like one thing. Mm -hmm. um, it just depends on the person. So something that looks chic on you may not look chic on me. Um, it's just your clean individual style is yeah. chic to me. I yeah. love that. I love that. <laughs> I love that. Absolutely. So I also have this thing where I want to call it the chic 
cheat sheet. Mm -hmm. So this is where we're asking you guys um, to kind of say, what can you do that's really quick, you know, to, you know, have chicness in your life? Because sometimes I think people think it's all about this big thing or a lot of money or whatever, you know, and I don't think it has to be that. I think it could be anything. Mm -hmm. So can you give um, us anything that's quick, and, you know, that you can be chic? Yeah, um, <laughs> Well, I kind of give two things. Okay, One, yeah, go anything. to the thrift store. Like thrift store, I'm girl. Trying to tell. Like go to the thrift store. Like that's that's kind of how I started. How, how long have you been thrifting? Like, Since like high school. Okay. Like, in high school, it was more so like um, I don't know if you remember wearing like the whole jean and blazer trend first yes. came into yes. like thing. I was uh -huh. in high school and that happened. Like um, or maybe I was in I don't know how old I was, but yeah. I was younger and. Blazers are kind of expensive, yeah, especially like for a high schooler. So, right. yeah, I think my mom mentioned, Well, go to the thrift store. Like, okay. I think she mentioned it. Like, she mom, she's not a thrifter or anything, but she mentioned it. And I was yeah. like, oh, Okay, and then I went there and I was like, oh, Okay, I'm kind of yeah, peeking around right. and I saw, you know, a little bit of stuff. I'm like, Okay, I can wear this and yeah. kind of, you know, put it with my older and newer stuff mm -hmm. and kind of got it working that way. Yeah. Um, but the thrift store is really a cheat sheet. Like, if Girl. you want to stand out, um, and save money and be stable. Save, yes. <laughs> and save the planet. Yes, save yes. the planet. All that in one. You feel like a better person. Yes, <laughs> like, yes. I love um, it. Go to the thrift store. And another chic tip, add a belt. Oh. It's going to pull it yes. together. Like, yes. If you're feeling like, dang, like it, it, it's missing something, put, yes. that, put that belt on. I and, love yeah. that. Yes. I love that. I love that. I know when I was growing up, I'm a lot older than this, this beautiful thing over here. <laughs> Thrifting was not a thing. Mm -hmm. Like, I always did it. Mm -hmm. Like, I have memories of being, gosh, two, two, three, four years old going to flea markets and mm -hmm. thrift stores with my, my um, father. And I've always been into it. And I remember people were like, where did you get that? Yeah, uh -huh. Like, it was not a thing in the 80s and 90s when I was in high school. <laughs> that it wasn't. But I always, and I literally have pieces from then mm -hmm. that I still wear. Like, where did you get that? I'm like, this is yeah. just from a thrift mm -hmm. store like 20 years ago. Yeah. So. <laughs> So I'm I'm happy though it's um a thing now because mm -hmm. it's endless like right. endless possibilities. It's like it's a good and bad thing. Like I'm glad people. Oh are right, because you're like wait a minute, yeah. yeah. But y'all, when I go to these thrift stores, they be charging regular price. Right, the prices are gone. Stuff, and I don't uh, appreciate that. No, like, that I you're you're and yes. I feel like the thrift store shouldn't do that. No, if, if they're listening. Uh, yes, <laughs> yes. They should that, I agree that. with that because I mean stuff that I used to pay like a dollar, two, and three. Ten, I was like, yeah, ten dollars. Like, oh, like, yeah. Oh. Now <laughs> exactly. you're looking for ten. You're like, whoa, I got a deal. Exactly. Where it wasn't like it was rare. You paid, mm -hmm. you know, ten dollars for something. So, yeah. All right, cool. So, what is next for Miss Tristan? Miss Tri Trix. Um. So I just had a baby. Yeah. So my whole life is changed. Uh -huh. <laughs> like, I know. So I know. And it, it forever will be. Yeah, look. <laughs> Every, literally day by day it changes yes. i'm like okay got this down and he does something different i'm like maybe okay. not let's yes. try again tomorrow <laughs> like, exactly. um so i definitely want to focus on um rebranding re and expanding okay um so i definitely want to do more um like we were talking earlier i feel like i'm you know i got the styling gig and then yes. talking to you i feel like i'm on that train like okay it's chugging yes. already so i'm gonna just keep it keep on it going on, yes. so definitely work on um Broadening my skills okay. and getting out there more. All right, yeah. cool, awesome. So, where can people find you? You can find me on Instagram at Fix by Tricks. That's F I X B Y T R I X. Yes, yes, <laughs> awesome, awesome. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm gonna cry. I'm a crier. I'm a, like emotional <laughs> because it's I'm I. Just super excited. Yes. I'm so grateful. I really appreciate you. You and me. If yeah. anybody hasn't, let me give you a flowers, girl. Because, like, Tori, like, you oh, are that girl. Like, you are really inspiration, like, for real. Now like, you're really making no, me cry. <laughs> <don't cry. laughs> like, even in school, like, it just felt like you were somebody to look up to. Like, because you, I knew you had your family and you were still going to school and you were still working. You know, it. Yeah. it's like, it. It's it's good to see another black woman do something that I aspire to do. So Aww, thank you. Thank and thank you for always being my friend. Yes, yes girl. Me. <laughs> this is for life. Yes, yes. All yes, right. Yes. Thank you guys so much. Thank you, Tristan, for being here. And we will be back and see y'all next time. Pasitos.